And a newer addition to this visitor center is the U.S. Water Ski and Wake Sports Hall of Fame and Museum. They used to have their own separate museum out on Interstate 4, but now it looks like they have brought the collection to the visitor center here in Davenport 27. And Dick Pope is the name you will see time and time again around these parts as he is the original owner and designer of Cypress Gardens. And I'm assuming this was one of the original boats that was used at Cypress Gardens for their world famous water ski shows. Let's see, is this old Dick Pope again? No, it is not, but look at those old water skis. Man. I'd be brave to be some of the first people to do these things for show. Sure. That is Ralph Samuel, the father of water skiing. There he is. What do you say, Ralphie? Thanks for being brave enough to strap some wood to your feet and be pulled at high speeds across the water. I salute you. I salute you. So this is the Water Ski and Wake Sports Hall of Fame Museum. It is inside the Visitor's Center, 27 and I-4 in Davenport, Florida. And so let's take off from here. Hit it! Ooh. And Bull County is the water ski capital of the world. I'm assuming maybe this is where water skiing was invented. Oh, there it is, 1922. July 2nd, Ralph Samuelson invented the sport of water skiing. He skied on two eight foot long pine wood planks with upturned ends and leather foot straps on Lake Pepin, Minnesota. So no, no, it was not here in Bull County. Um, Minnesota, apparently. That's all right, they took off. And did they own thing here in Bull County? And of course, it is documented quite thoroughly <clears throat> here at the Visitor Center and Water Ski Museum. All kinds of nooks and crannies. Very cool. Winter Haven, the city of a thousand lakes. Drinkski. Is that the brand that has fallen by the wayside? Ski. Yes, very extensive water skiing and water sports museum. You know, people drive past these places, never pop in, and you never know what kind of treasures are waiting inside. That's why I say, stop, get out, walk around. You never know what you'll find. And of course, those water ski shows, world famous at Cypress Gardens. Looks like they also did them in Marine World and of course Sea World as well in Orlando. Oh, there's some Sea World branded water skis. And I believe the video for Vacation by the Bangles? Is it the Bangles? I don't know. But uh, that was filmed at Cypress Gardens. And yeah. Again, just imagine being one of the first person to 
Strap some wood to your feet and be pulled at high speeds across the water. You gotta be a clown. Oh look, there is a clown. Comedy and show skiing. Now I don't believe that this is from Circus World, but right across the street from where this visitor center is, used to be a theme park called Circus World. It was the winter home of the Ringling Brothers and Barnum & Bailey Circus. And then that became Boardwalk and Baseball. Now it is a shopping center called Posner Park. Thank you, Corky. So I stand corrected. The music video Vacation was by the Go-Go's, and that was filmed at Cypress Gardens, not the Bengals, the Go-Go's. This is definitely new. One of the many films made here in Polk County. Easy to Love with Esther Williams, filmed at Cypress Gardens, and it appears they have found one of the costumes that she wore in the film. This water ski costume was packed in a box for 33 years in the Cypress Garden wardrobe department. It was about to be disposed of when it was rescued for this museum. One of a dozen identical suits worn by Esther Williams. And there it is. That is very cool. Mm -hmm. 